Greetings, Neo2 Guru here. And here's the top seven character creation lookalikes that people have made. Why top seven? No reason. Why not? And at seven, we have Big Boss, I'm told. I thought it was Solid Snake, because they look the same, but it's some kind of clone, some nonsensical backstory. They all look the same, so it may as well be Solid Snake. It's whoever you want it to be. But you can bring the Metal Gear hero into Neo, where there's no stealth, or guns, or grenades. Snake's got to man up and fight with a sword. But make the most of Snake here because now there's no more Kojima at Konami. Maybe we'll never see Snake again. But here at six, Danny Trejo, the Mexican actor badass. From such hit films as Heat, Desperado, Dust Till Dawn, etc. So you can imagine Machete himself hanging out in the world of ancient Edo, Japan killing demons and directed by Robert Rodriguez. Doesn't look exactly like him, but a close approximation. Almost looks a little bit like John Carpenter too. Doesn't really fit or make any key sense, but who cares? It's your game, do what you want with it. And here we have 2B from Nier Automata, a game I've actually never played, but apparently it's a great game, a visually memorable one, so with this character, you can merge the two games together. Why you'd want to do that, I don't know. Just go play Neo. This is Neo. Different. But if you're that massive a fanboy of that game and can't get enough of this character, someone's gone to the trouble to help you. Maybe one day I'll get to playing that game. Here we see someone created Ron Perlman, the Hellboy actor. Or a close approximation of him. He looks a little bit dopey compared to the real man, looks baffled by why he's here. And he looks pleased about it with a permanent grin. He's happy to come and pwn demons. I don't think I've even seen Hellboy, so what if he killed demons in that? Maybe it makes sense. It's quite why you'd want to play with Ron Perlman. I don't know. But here it is if you want to. You'll love it. Now we have Margot Robbie's Harley Quinn. Again, haven't seen any of those movies, but I've seen the trailers. And it looks pretty accurate from what I can tell. And maybe it suits the game. There's almost a blank, Japanese, ghoul look to it. Kind of works. I don't know about the hair, but Margot Robbie was pretty hmm yeah in The Wolf of Wall Street. That's all I know. Got no problem with anyone playing with her. Whether it fits or makes sense, who cares? Now we have the God of War himself, but in his late teens, early twenties. Doesn't really look like he did in any God of War game. He looks a bit young. Maybe when Kratos was first starting out. The young Kratos, before he'd really hit the gym properly too. He's big, but not Kratos big. The gods hadn't supplied him with enough steroids at this critical point in his, his life. He's almost a bit too pretty, pretty boy Kratos. And the Neo character's a bit of a wimp. He's no Kratos. So it doesn't even work and make key sense, but if you want more Kratos, here it is. And for unknown reasons, here's Kanye West in Neo, the so-called rap genius, although I don't know any of his songs apart from that Gold Digger one. And that's only because the best bit in it is an old Ray Charles song sample. Ray Charles, actual genius, Kanye, actual clown. But if you've got bad taste and like his music, you can play with him in Neo too. Although I believe him kicking ass against demons about as much as I believe he's a genius. But it's your game, enjoy it how you will. If you want to play with these characters, the codes to download them are in the description. Farewell for now. As usual, everything the Guru does look, makes, it, looks, makes it look easy, but it's totally stupid as usual as tactic. I think I'm going to use my tactic, which is to summon people. The ghoul faces, they come through the wall and insta-powered. I don't want to follow his guard, I'm just going to call for his help. 